is good, YouTube? Quinn Wade Basketball Analysis coming to you on a quick video. I wanted to let you guys know I got some new merchandise available, not just t-shirt anymore. I got different type of t-shirt, different type of shirts and logos that you can purchase on my spread shirt and also hoodies now. We have expanded and added more to the channel and more merchandise for the brand. Thanks for supporting. It will be in the description and the links will be in the comment section below. Thanks for helping me and supporting the movement. Quinn Wade Basketball Analysis, I'm going. What well, is good, YouTube? Quinn Way basketball analysis coming to y'all with a quick video. Today, we're going to talk about Joe Kim Noah signing with the Los Angeles Clippers. Obviously, this is a move that we thought wasn't going to happen. So a lot of people thought that the Clippers were going a different direction, not going with um, Joe Kim Noah. He's been out for a while, he got passed up by a lot of teams. He even got passed up by the Lakers when they ended up getting Dwight Howard, which a lot of people realize and bring up. And he isn't the same player. He's not a guy that's going to get you 30. He's not a guy that's going to be defensive player of the year. Not a guy that's going to be the biggest difference maker. I don't think he's going to play that much and get, you know, an opportunity to do that anyway, like he did in Memphis last season. I just think at the end of the day, he's going to have opportunity to come in here and play 10 to 15 minutes on some games, some nights, get a couple rebounds, set a couple screens, and just be Joe Kim Noah. I think that's going to be the most important thing because that's what he brings to the table at this point in his career because he's not an offensive player, not the greatest defensive player, not the greatest scorer, not the greatest free throw shooter. He, he just going to have to bring what he does best and – Hopefully that's enough. I just want to see Joe Kim Noah go out on a team like this, a team that's defensive-minded, a team that's very slow and grindy, a team that's very smart and and well, you know, educated on what they're trying to do offensively and defensively each and every night, and a team that's veteran-led. This is a team that is mostly veterans, and they don't really have that much young talent on this team. They just have a bunch of dogs, a bunch of defenders, a bunch of people that want to bang, a bunch of people that want to go out there and defend and play hard. And you don't see a lot of teams built like that anymore, especially because it's more of an older model. You just see a different team than you would um, at the end of the day. It's just a different team right now. But other than that, I'm not going to really go too hard on this one just because Joe Kim Noah hasn't played in months we don't really know what he's gonna be we don't really know what's gonna be anyway because he's coming off injury and we don't really expect him to play that much especially on this team it does it's good for them to have extra size it's good for them to have a guy that can actually play still and it is good for them to actually have a guy that can get it done and he has proved that even last season that he can still play, he can still contribute, he can still do some things, even if it's not at the greatest level, even if it's not what he used to be, which he shouldn't be because he's older. But it is good if he can have a chance to win a title on a team that's getting hot, um, starting to figure it out, starting to put things together. And, you know, it'll be good to see him have a chance to win the championship this season, which he didn't have to do. But he didn't have a chance the last couple of seasons. And now he has a legitimate chance this season to win it all. And it'd be good to see if he really can get it done. But other than that, I don't really have much to say about Joe Kim Noah signing a contract with the Los Angeles Clippers, taking up that spot, um, allowing them to go in with a full roster, I believe. And now they're fully loaded. Now they got that big that they've been waiting to get. And I think he is the best available big left compared to, you know, the Lakers being able to pick anybody. I think this is really, you know, who's who's and who's left now. And, you know, I think they made the right pickup. And I think that they picked him up, you know, at the end of the day at a good time, too, because now he was probably ready to go after the injury. And now, you know, he's going to have a different type of motivation that he got picked up and has a chance to win the title. And he's playing for a team that fits his style and fits his type of game and allows him to be who he is. And that's what you always want when you get picked up by a team. But other than that, check him out. Facebook page, analysisplayground.com. Link in the description, comment section below. 
check out my website and also playground.com link in the description comment section below if you new like on facebook thanks for liking on facebook also thanks for checking out my merchandise like i said in the beginning of the video also if you didn't know you can buy merchandise on facebook you can message me and get a t-shirt or a logo i mean a t-shirt and a logo you can put the t-shirt and a logo any color that you want just message me the color that you want message me the color of the logo that you want on the shirt and i can get it shipped out to you but um that's it coin way basketball announced to sign out and this is about joe kim noah signing with the los angeles clippers um and we'll see what happens with him